In the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful. Hi, my name is Khalid, and today I will teach everyone how to set up their website using Adobe Dreamweaver CS3 or CS4. Let's go ahead and get started. First, right click on your desktop, choose New Folder. Name this folder My Website. Double click and open up that folder. And then right click within that folder and choose New Folder. And name this folder HTML. Double click and open up HTML folder. Right click within the HTML folder and select New Folder. And name this Images. Once you're done with that, uh, close this folder. Open up Adobe Dreamweaver CS3 or CS4. Click on Site, New Site, and make sure you have the Advanced tab selected. For the site name, you will name this My Website, or whatever you want to call it, whatever you want to call your site. Um, local root folder will be uh, My Website. HTML and uh, default images folder will be images and leave everything else uh, at their default settings click OK so now uh, in the fi files panel you have two folders you have images and you have HTML next thing you want to do is create your HTML documents. Do this by clicking right on the on HTML and choose new file. Name this file index.html. This is the file that Google and all the big search engines and all the search engines worldwide look for uh, this page. This would be your home page. Um, next click on HTML create another file and name this members.html click on html new file name this downloads.html and we'll create one more file and this one will be called contact dot html now that you have all of your html files created double click on uh, index.html and it brings up the code and the design view um, you have three options you could either use the code and never display the the design there's also another way of displaying the design you can just press F12 to save and preview your um, your HTML document on the web uh, uh, through Internet Explorer or you can just click on split and that way you'll have your code up top and the design view on the bottom let's go ahead and add a background so I can show you what I mean we'll use a BG color of black and right now you don't see anything but if you click on uh, the design uh, if you click on the design view the page turns black so that means you now have a background color of black for your index.html file um, you can also you also have other options um, if you click on view and you click on split vertically your code will be on the left and the design will be on the right and if you click on window and then workspace layout you can choose from eight different types of um, layouts right now I have classic because classic is probably one of the best layouts there is you have from 
common layout, uh, forms, data, SPRY, in content editing, text, and favorites, to tables, images, media, and so on and so forth. I'm going to uncheck split vertically because I like the fact that the code is on top and the design view is on the bottom so I, I can see everything as I code. Um, that does it for this tutorial. Uh, please look forward to part two. Uh, part two will uh, include how to uh, add tables and basically set up and and basically show you how to lay out a, a website um, in HTML format. Thank you so much for watching. Please leave comments. Have a great day. Bye-bye.